Good morning, everyone. This is Ironwood Becker. Welcome to the Tigers Club. If you're new here, um, so I want to talk about gold. Um, as you can see from some of my posts, I am a firm believer in gold as a form of wealth. And so I also wanted to, so I'm a big proponent of it. I work with a company um, where I help, I directly help people um, exchange their cash for gold. And what that does for you is it helps to protect your time and your assets. And as you can tell from the hashtags, I say that um, gold is real money. And I'd say that gold can take the heat. Aside from gold being some form of money for over 2,500 years, it is still used to balance portfolios and as well as to um, protect assets. Robert Kiyosaki talks about how he... Um, he always he always buys enough silver and gold, gold and silver, to protect whatever um, whatever property he's buying, um, which means he's using it to protect his assets, to balance, uh, to um, counterbalance the debt he incurs with a new property. Now, recently, I. I learned that a friend of mine, a business partner, that her house burned down. And she um she didn't talk about it. The team didn't hear about it until this last week when she was sharing on her um during our team meeting. And in in her story she says that um everyone was okay, the house burned down. And as they went back through the ashes to see what was left, the one thing they found, the only thing they found really of value was their gold that they had stored at their home. And what that's one of the things that has made gold such a precious, precious and um, powerful form of money all these centuries is it can take the heat. Uh, paper money gone. If you would have, if you would have had five ounces of gold at home, or a little, a little above under five and a half thousand dollars, when your house burnt down, if you would have had cash, gone. It's paper. Now, having gold. It survived the heat. It took the heat, and it um, it came through. They were able to take it out of the the wreckage of their home, and um, do whatever they want with it. Um, because gold is real money, and it provides long term longevity. It protects wealth long term. Uh, Robert Kiyosaki teaches this. Jim Rickards teaches this. Um, just to name a few guys. And I'm sharing this because the whole point of this group is to help other people understand the importance of getting and having gold to protect your time and your assets. That's the time you give in the labor of your job, whether you get an hourly wage or you get a salary it protects your assets because it can be used in exchange for um, paper currency, fiat, if you will. And then that money can be then put towards any debts that you have if you have to sell gold, if you have to sell some of it to obtain um, to obtain some of that. So, my friends. If you get value from this video, please like and share it. If you're interested in saving gold, drop a drop a message down below, um, or you can hit my um, website, saveandearngold.com. There's a video there that talks about the difference of income and wealth, and then there's a link there to um, 
the business that I have, that I'm part of. And there's also a couple um, videos on there by G. Edward Griffin, who is also a firm believer in having a solid monetary system based on gold or silver um, for the U.S. government. And he talks a little bit about the importance of having physical gold. Um, for book recommendations, you can go to bit.ly or bit.ly slash Iron Will Book List. And there's over 50 books on there, ranging from all different topics. There's also podcasts and YouTube channels on there that you can check out to increase your knowledge and education. Thanks again, my friends, for spending time with me. I hope you go out and make it a great day. I hope you go out and make it a great weekend. Talk to you later.